Okay, tropical plant update. The funny thing is, yesterday I said we needed rain really bad, and it was, oh, the thumbnail too. And of course, 20 minutes, not even 20 minutes after I did the video, it downpoured and it downpoured all day. We got maybe two inches of rain. We're supposed to get a lot more today. We're supposed to have um, some bad storms and a lot of heavy downpour. So these plants are doing good. Don't have to water anything today, and they're definitely enjoying um, the tropical weather because very hot humidity right now. It's hot and humid. Especially the coconut tree is definitely really, really enjoying it. We got the pomegranate in the back with all the flowers. I put everything in the back here so the wind comes the wind comes towards this way. And so I don't want anything to break. If there's anything, it'll just go up against the house and have some protection that way from um, bending. Because we don't want to bend too far or else we can have an incident where stuff breaks. And that, that'll be really, really bad. Okay, I'm trying to find the oranges. I can't. Oh, they're on the opposite side by the. Ouch. By the wall. Nice looking oranges there. Very happy if I find another one or somewhere. Oh, there they are. They're all looking good. All the baby oranges. Hopefully, don't make it the whole way. I think it's the pomegranates too. We keep getting closer and closer, closer each year, so hopefully this year we'll get even a little bit closer. Um, we got the lemon tree right here looking really good. A lot of new leaves. This is end up being like the orange tree last year and just just take off during the summer it's gonna be pretty big it's probably it might be close to that size by the end of it it's already getting pretty tall same as the lime tree we got a lot of new leaves we got some baby limes grown that's all looking good pies down here looking good we got part of the, the flower on the pomegranate that this is they're all doing really good to be a year in august coming up the fig looking really good we got a lot of new leaves on that and you got the banana tree right next to it down here what's left from the pot palm tree there the wine and flowers looking good. That's also gonna be a year coming up in August. Basil looking good. Um, part of the hibiscus. We're trying to get back alive again. We have another one planted with my banana trees. I'll show you guys in a second. And then we got this right here. We got um, oh, we got um, strawberries. So they're all everything's doing good over here. All tropical plants. Everything normally they're on top of here, but since it's gonna rain, oh, I'm gonna go and get a nice soaking. This is a hibiscus. There was a flower on it, but the flower already falls off. It only lasts maybe a day or two. We got another one grown here. These are, though, we got the um, native ones of Hawaii. The Hawaiian, I think it's a state flower too, which is yellow. That's the kind we got. We got the band tree right there. We got some new growth there. Then we got some other cool looking plants that we grown at the base of it. It looks really cool. I'm very excited to see what it looks like by August. It's probably going to look pretty cool. Okay, we got. This one over here, we got the uh, pineapple plant. This is the third year ready for it. Hopefully, we'll be getting some pineapple soon. But I think it's the winter that hurts it and takes it takes makes it a little bit longer. So hopefully, by summer we'll have it. Um, I might do my trick at night because I want to do it during the day because it'll get too hot in the bag. I might do the bag at night with the the apple. So I suppose it's all size. So that should be good to go on that. That's how you. That's how it's a way to to make it force flower because. Uh, CO2 coming off the orange. We got all these in here, all the flowers. Everything looking good. We start with one, now we have like maybe 20 or 30 flowers now. We got these starting these in 2009. I think we got the range original one was yellow. Then we got a couple other ones, but I know it's, and they all started mixed together. They're looking good, so it's about to rain again. It was a rainstorm all day. Um, yeah, the plants are already moved, so we get any bad winds. We don't have any issues of them breaking or anything falling over and getting damaged. But last but not least, we have over here the banana trees. When it gets a hard rain and these aren't here, it's a big giant puddle almost up to the window. Almost over top of the brick too. But these plants definitely absorb the water and that's really good. They get mostly shade and a little bit of sun. And these plants, these banana plants do the best here out of anywhere uh, around the house. So that's why we keep putting them here. So that's what's going on guys. Hope you guys enjoy this update. I'll see you guys tomorrow. For our awesome updates, thank you guys for watching.